Osman Karajuli from Doha News. Uh, we are seeing reports right now of the United States evacuating its citizens from the entirety of the region and sending troops to the area. So does this suggest that de-escalation talks have, re have, have not been able to reach any progress yet? And can we say that, and what, what is Qatar actively doing in order to prevent a multinational war from happening? Since the beginning of this uh, conflict, we have uh, made our contacts with all relevant parties to make sure that uh, all uh, talk of uh, escalation beyond the current parameters of, uh, of the conflict is, uh, does not materialize on, uh, on the ground. We have talked to our partners in the region and uh, beyond, and I think this message was heard uh, very clearly from our, uh, our partners. The developments on, uh, on the ground are certainly uh, alarming, especially in the West Bank and, uh, and uh, South uh, Lebanon, and we urge all parties uh, to, uh, uh, you know, to, to stop any uh, escalation that might result in widening the scope of the current, uh, the current escalation. Uh, we are confident that with the help of our uh, regional partners and international partners, we will be able to contain uh, this, uh, this conflict, but uh, certainly the dangers of this conflict becoming a widespread regional uh, conflict is something that is not only a threat to us here in the region, but it's a threat to international peace altogether.